I wrote the mini book, Help, I Want to Change, to encourage believers who struggle with remaining sin to see how the Bible teaches that change takes place. Change is founded on the gospel. It's not merely putting forth effort. Paul in Romans says, consider yourselves dead to sin and alive to God in Christ. It's our identity in Christ and understanding that identity and living out that identity that enables us to be conformed to Christ. And so change begins with the gospel and understanding who we are in Christ and his power at work in us. But then also the Bible teaches that change involves effort and that we are called by God in the power of the Spirit in light of the gospel to do those things that please God. Now we cannot do those in the strength of the flesh, but by the Spirit. It's, it's like Peter getting out of the boat to walk on the water. He is incapable of himself to walk on water. But as he kept his eyes on Jesus, he was able to obey, to get out of the boat and walk towards him. And for us, in areas we, in which we struggle in our lives, as we look to Christ and what he has done in the gospel, then we also do what he tells us to do. And by his grace, we are transformed.